So when you see pit bulls as puppies, do you think they're more aggressive than the other puppies? They are a very high energy dog. Normally, if you take a puppy of this breed, uh, you have to do a lot of negative influences in their life for them to become aggressive to humans. Right. Unfortunately, we see a lot of cases of abuse with American pit bull terriers, and that can be hard on a dog's temperament, as you know. Yeah. And it's very important that the dog be healthy. It's very important that the dog be sound, temperament-wise. If bred properly and raised in the right environment, they can be the most wonderful companion for your family. If the owner doesn't put guidelines and doesn't train the dog properly from the beginning, it makes it much harder for that dog to coexist in the family. You know, we've had a lot of wonderful people come in who've also rescued, you know, the former fighting dogs. and So you also rescue pits? Yes, I do. So you breed and you rescue? Correct. Okay. We had one dog that had actually been chained out in a backyard, and she was being starved. She had all her teeth worn down from trying to chew on the chain to get away. And what was amazing is when this dog was removed from that chain and she was brought into an environment, she was wonderful with people. She was wonderful with kids. Isn't it amazing? She was good with other dogs. And to be that forgiving after going through all of that is just amazing. And it truly shows you what these dogs are about and what their temperament is like. Right. Although some experts and breeders like Deanna believe that pit bulls are not born any more aggressive toward humans than other breeds, the fact is backyard breeding, improper training, and neglect have led to a rise in pit bull violence all across America. But if a pit bull isn't really born to be bad, can a bad dog be retrained to be good?